often referred to as the gateway to the Smokies. Gatlinburg is a town of just 4,200 residents set in the Appalachian Mountains of East Tennessee. But don't be fooled by its small population, Gatlinburg is one of the most visited towns in America. You'll be amazed by all of the fun things to do in Gatlinburg and the nearby Smoky Mountains. From whitewater rafting to skiing to sipping craft beer and moonshine, there is truly something for everyone in Gatlinburg. Whether you crave the outdoors, history and museums, cozy cabins, and comfort food, or action-packed adventure you can find it all in Gatlinburg. Each of these fun things to do in Gatlinburg is so awesome that you just might have to make a second trip to do all of them. So here is the list of 10 best things to do in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. Before we start, make sure you subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon for the latest upcoming travel videos. Here we go. Number 10. Whitewater Rafting on the Pigeon River If you're looking to get your adrenaline fix during your trip to Gatlinburg, then how about a little whitewater rafting? In fact, rafting the nearby Pigeon River is considered one of the best things to do in the Smoky Mountains. Most rafting outfitters in town offer two different trips on the Pigeon River. The Upper Pigeon River is the more exciting, and more popular, of the two trips. Over the course of 5.5 miles, you'll raft through 60-plus rapids including 12 Class 3 rapids and 3 heart-pounding Class 4 rapids. Kids generally need to be at least 8 years old and weigh over 70 pounds to raft this section of the Pigeon River. The Lower Pigeon River is a much more mellow 5.5-mile float that is geared towards families with young children or anyone that prefers taking in the beautiful mountain scenery over navigating Class 4 rapids. Number 9. Hollywood Star Cars Museum The Hollywood Star Cars Museum houses 40 cars from Hollywood movies and TV shows. On the hour-long tour of this exciting museum, visitors have the opportunity to view the jalopy from the Beverly Hillbillies, two Batmobiles one from the original TV show, and one from Batman Returns, the Ghostbusters Ecto-1 van, the DeLorean made famous in Back to the Future, and General Lee from the Dukes of Hazzard. Recent acquisitions include cars from the Fast and the Furious movies, Paul McCartney's Cadillac, and the 1955 Thunderbird that belonged to the Beach Boys. The museum has a gift shop and offers visitors a chance to pose for commemorative photos in cars from the museum's collection. Number 8. Ripley's Aquarium of the Smokies the best of a number of Ripley's attractions in Gatlinburg, Ripley's Aquarium of the Smokies features plenty of exotic marine life from around the world. Highlights include a submerged acrylic tunnel, allowing visitors to see sharks and other ocean predators up close, and interactive exhibits including the always popular Touch Array Bay. For a truly memorable experience, consider signing up for one of the fun penguin experiences, which include petting one of these amazing creatures, or don your bathing suit and swim with the stingrays. According to recent visitors, the tunnel, the sharks, and the resident mermaid were a hit with kids. But more than one reviewer noted that the aquarium is somewhat dated, and that the large crowds make it difficult to enjoy, especially with young children. Still, many families who visit often said this is an experience that they enjoy year after year. Number 7. Ober Gatlinburg Amusement Park and Ski Area Ober Gatlinburg has so much mountaintop fun to offer visitors and locals. Getting to the peak in an enclosed tram car is part of the fun, and there are many ways to enjoy the descent even more. The Ski Mountain Coaster is a family-friendly ride that takes five and a half minutes and travels over a mile. 
There are two alpine slides 1,800 feet in length that travel through the woods to the mountain's base. Visitors young and old can play mini golf, get lost in a maze, try out chair swings, ride an indoor carousel, or let the kids run around a kiddie playground. Winter visitors raved about the ski instructors, but bemoaned the long lines and lack of tickets for snow tubing on weekends and during holidays when the demand for this activity far exceeds the available reservation times. Number 6. Gatlinburg Space Needle. If you can't get enough of the scenery in Gatlinburg, you won't want to miss the Gatlinburg Space Needle. It rises more than 400 feet in the air, and provides 360 degrees aerial views of both the city skyline and the mountains looming beyond it, so it's definitely one of the top 10 things to do in the area. You'll start by entering the Gatlinburg Space Needle through the downstairs lobby. From there, you can hit up arcades, pizza joints, souvenir shops, and many other tourist attractions. When you're ready to ascend, take the glass elevator to the very top of the observation deck and enjoy the landscape stretching before you. You'll be able to see for miles on a clear day. The viewfinders are free of charge too, so you won't even need to buy a pair of binoculars. If you're looking for the best things to do in Gatlinburg, consider the Gatlinburg Space Needle. It's a sight for sore eyes, and it'll give you a vacation experience that you won't soon forget. Number 5. Sweet Fanny Adams Theater. Laugh until your sides are sore at the Sweet Fanny Adams Theater. It's the only live comedy theater in Gatlinburg, and it'll offer all of the songs, dances, jokes, and poofy skirts that you'd expect from a vaudeville-style performance. This isn't the kind of theater where you sit in respectful silence at the tearjerker tale being depicted in front of you. Instead, you'll be dragged right into the fun with audience participation segments in various skits and musical numbers. The actors will be loud. The crowd will be even louder. The comedy routines will vary, but they'll always show you a good time. Maybe you're planning a unique date night. Maybe you've always wanted to catch a show at a real vaudeville theater. Whatever your reasons for looking into the sweet Fanny Adams Theater, it'll definitely provide top-tier entertainment in Gatlinburg. Number 4. Over Gatlinburg Aerial Tramway. Ober Gatlinburg is a ski resort and amusement park offering year-round recreational activities. The complex includes a chairlift, indoor ice skating, skiing, an alpine slide, kiddie land, and the wildlife encounter, habitat for native creatures such as black bears, river otters, and possums. Getting there is half the fun, with most visitors opting for the two-mile-long aerial tramway, which departs from downtown Gatlinburg and offers superb views along the way. The chairlift from Ober Gatlinburg includes a 30-minute ride to the summit with its scenic lookout. Although most recent visitors said the views were amazing, some described the cable car ride as scary. Others were disappointed with the state of the attractions at the top, and more than one recent guest complained about the customer service. However, other travelers loved the variety of shops, as well as the ski mountain coaster and the alpine slide. Number 3. Gatlinburg Arts and Crafts Community. Looking for the perfect souvenir or holiday gifts? You're in luck. The Gatlinburg Arts and Crafts Community is a small part of Gatlinburg that has been home to artists and craftsmen for over 70 years. Visitors can stroll about the area and see tons of homemade gifts and goods for sale. Some of the artists specialize in glassblowing, painting, sculpting, and broom making. Most recent visitors said this was a great way to find special souvenirs unique to the area. Several shoppers recommended picking up the complimentary map in advance to help you decide which of the more than 100 shops and galleries to visit.
and some mentioned perks like free parking and out-of-state shipping services offered by many of the stores. Number 2. Mountain Moonshine Tastings As you walk around Gatlinburg you'll no doubt start to notice several establishments selling moonshine. You'll probably be thinking to yourself, isn't moonshine illegal? Has the town of Gatlinburg totally forsaken the rule of law for a quick tourist dollar? Well, the only thing that ever really made moonshine illegal was that no one paid taxes on it to the federal government. There is nothing actually illegal about distilling grain alcohol, known as white dog, which is then aged in oak barrels to make whiskey. In fact, the generic grain alcohol is often sold to college students as Everclear. All of these, moonshine distilleries are essentially just selling Everclear in mason jars, very clever marketing. That being said, Gatlinburg's moonshine distilleries are fun to visit and typically offer free samples of their hooch. Plus you can see the distilling process and pick up a unique boozy gift for your friends back home. The shine is infused with dozens of different flavors you can choose from ranging from the ever-popular apple pie to stranger choices like maple bacon or peanut butter and jelly. I always think the best way to consume moonshine is when it has been soaked into fruit, so be sure to try the moonshine cherries or moonshine peaches. Number 1. Great Smoky Mountains National Park The Great Smoky Mountains National Park is a forested region, with impressive mountains reaching more than 6,500 feet high. A central range of the Appalachians running east-west, the Smokies get their name from the mist that frequently rises out of the valleys like smoke signals. Travelers enjoy the mountains year-round, hikers and mountain bikers during spring, summer, and fall, and skiers in winter. A number of excellent visitor centers offer guides and easy access to the most scenic areas, and numerous campsites are dotted around the park. One of the highlights is the park's flora, a mix of deciduous and conifer forests, as well as more than 1,400 species of flowering plants including mountain magnolias, wild azaleas, mountain laurels, orchids, and rhododendrons. All told, more than 900 miles of hiking trails crisscross the park, and many visitors also come for the fly fishing, widely considered as some of the best in the country. The last word. So guys, this was the bestest list of things to do in Gatlinburg, Tennessee, hope you will like it and appreciate it. People who come to this city are amazed by all of the awesome things there are to do and see. There is a visitor's center with rangers on duty to help answer any questions you might have about the park. You can fish, hike, camp, and go horseback riding all in one place with the most breathtaking scenery surrounding you which is why it tops our fun things to do in Gatlinburg list. So if you love to travel, and you want to see the whole world then Tripoyer is the channel that gives you a list of the best places to visit in the world. Make sure you subscribe the channel and press the bell icons for latest upcoming travel videos. Bye bye see you.